For other historical characters named Megabyzis, see Megabyzis. Megabyzis was a Rachimenid Persian general, son of Zopyrus, satrap of Babylonia. His father was killed when the satrapi rebelled in 482 BC, and Megabyzis led the forces that recaptured the city, after which the statue of the god Marduk was destroyed to prevent future revolts. Megabyzes subsequently took part in the expedition against Greece. Herodotus claims that he refused to act on orders to pillage Delphi, but it is doubtful such orders were ever given. According to Ctecas, who is not especially reliable but is often our only source, Amatis, wife of Megabyzes and daughter of Xerxes, was accused of adultery shortly afterwards. As such, Megabyzus took part in the conspiracy of Artabanus to assassinate the emperor, but betrayed him before he could kill the new emperor Artaxerxes as well. In a battle, Artabanus' sons were killed and Megabyzus was wounded, but Amatis interceded on his behalf and he was cured. After this Megabyzus became satrap of Syria. Together with Artabazush, satrap of Phrygia, he had command of the Persian army sent to put down the revolt of Inarus in Egypt. They arrived in 456 BC, and within two years had put down the revolt, capturing Inarus and various Athenians supporting him. They then turned their attention to Cyprus, which was under attack by the Athenians, led by Chimon. Shortly afterwards hostilities between Persia and Athens ceased, called the Peace of Callias. Sometime later Megabyzus himself revolted. CTEC as tells us the reason was that Amstrus had the captives from the Egyptian revolt executed, though Megabyzus had given his word that they would not be harmed. Armies under Uzairus of Egypt and then Prince Manistanes, a nephew of the king, were sent against him, both foregoing battle for duels between the generals, and in both cases Megabyzus was victorious. The king resolved to send his brother Artarius, the eunuch Artox says an amateurs in a peace embassy. His honor restored, Megabyzus agreed to surrender and was pardoned, retaining his position. Sometime later, Megabyzus saved Artaxerxes from a lion in a hunt was subsequently exiled to Seatai for violating the royal prerogative to make the first kill, but returned to Susa by pretending to be a leper and was pardoned. Megabyzus died shortly afterwards, at age 76. His son Zopyrus II is known to have visited Athens and aided in its assault on Cornus during his father's exile, where he was killed by a rock.